Hey guys, real quick before the video actually starts, I forgot to mention you're going to need either WinRAR, blah, blah, WinRAR or 7-Zip or something like that, you know, to uh, open up those files. I just felt like I didn't need to say it because if you're using uh, emulators, you probably already have these things anyway. But, you know, if I'm going to do a tutorial, I might as well tell you everything. But uh, just keep that in mind. But you can watch the video now. Yo, what is going on guys, it's your boy Mikael or Place here back with another video and uh, I'm going to get straight into it. So, you're going to need one of two things and the first one is a flash drive, but if you don't have a flash drive, you can use the method I'm about to show you, which is way better anyway, even though I have a flash drive, is either Google Drives or you're going to want like some way to like some type of way where you can grab a file off of your old computer and put it on to your new computer basically so i use google drives for that now um i'm letting you guys know now this is the wii version i'm going to be making a gamecube version and a ps2 version so um i'm gonna cut to my files because that's basically what you need uh so let me show you okay so once you get to your files or your folders or whatever and you get to the dolphin like 64 thing where after you get this file after you download the dolphin um emulator so you should already see this you just find it and then um there's gonna be a f you can't see it on here because i changed the name of it for my personal use uh oh yeah because i plugged in a usb um you're gonna look for the file that says private right and then it, sh it, sh it would be this one but after you click it there's gonna be another file in it called uh we and there's gonna be another file in it called titles and then after you click it it'll pull up a bunch of these oh it would be this right here. yeah private we title right so after you get there you're gonna see this a bunch of random stuff for like you know uh, your games these are your games save files and at first this stuff made no sense to me but basically what it is is when you come to dolphin uh, obviously I don't have all my games on here but like for example if you click on a game if you right click a game and then click property right there was there's going to be a you see this this kind of whatever this R N E E D A. you're looking for the first four letters right so you see how this is R N E E you're wanna you're gonna wanna go to uh you're gonna go to the back to that file and then R N E E. That's that would be that Naruto file, because that's for the game that I was playing. This is Naruto Shippuden Clash of Ninja Revolution 2. But before you do all that, what you wanna do is um go on your old computer, right? And you're gonna wanna take all these files. You're gonna wanna take all of them, right? You're going to go to your Google Docs or whatever site you use. Don't even have Google Docs up. Kind of bought it right now. Um, you're going to want to take your your file. You want to click New. And then you want to click Folder. Oh, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Folder Upload. So after you go to Folder Upload, basically you're just going to... Um, say file private we you're gonna want to click the title file because that's what's gonna have all of the other like that's what's gonna have all of these in them so just click the title file and then after you click the title file you want to click upload I'm not gonna do that because I've already done it and then after you do that you're gonna wait for it to um, finish uploading and then after you do that you're gonna go on to your new PC or whatever other PC you're trying to use, right? You're gonna go back into your Google Drive or whatever site you used, and you're gonna download it because it's gonna be there. For example, um, like it's it's gonna be here somewhere in there. Um, ignore the shit that I have on here. So after it's on your computer and it's on your PC, I recommend changing the name title to something like me. I change it to save files because. That's literally what they are. They're save files. 
So after you have them on your PC, on your new PC, right? You're going to want to go to Dolphin. Oh, by the way, what you're looking for are where where's the any you're looking for this data bin thing right so that's what you're looking for so when you go into dolphin you're gonna go and click on whatever game you need to have a save file for it. you see how it's like this x right here that's because there's no save file for it so and i don't even think i have a controller set up right but regardless of whether i do or i don't just to show you real quick i'm gonna speed this shit up would you like to create a game data yes 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 just speeding it up that was loud as fuck holy shit um this is gonna be really loud uh, or at least for me it is i don't know hold on hold on hold on sorry i don't know if this is loud for you guys but it's very loud for me uh where is it where is it holy shit sorry that was really loud for me Sorry, no, not Streamlabs. Uh, 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 goddamn, goddamn. What am I doing? <laughs> Sorry. Okay, so I got 50,000 real because I had a save file. Yeah, I, I had a save file from this. But anyway, just to show you. Shut up, Sakura. Um, just to show you, there is nothing on here. I, this is a brand new game. But now that I have the save file, right? Now that I have it, I'm gonna refresh. Now look, there's a save file. So which one to do? Okay, so after, like I said, after you figured out on your properties what the first uh, four characters are, you wanna go to tools and then you wanna click, um, where is it? I'm, I can't see. Uh, import we save, not export all we save. That's not what you wanna do. You want to click import we save then you want to go to your your files and then you want to click you want to look for that what it said it was r n e e for that particular game so you click it then you want to click data bin that's that's the save file basically now they're going to ask you do you want to you know basically overwrite the save file yes obviously you do now it's imported so you go back into the game right 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 i'm going to speed this up because don't really care to see it. Yeah. So when you go back in, your save file should be there. I'm just gonna go in and check just to show you. Um, I have I should have every character except for Anbu Kakashi. Yeah, <laughs> I don't have Anbu Kakashi yet. But this is my save file. Um. If you are doing, actually, yeah, that's pretty much all it is to it. I, I was tripping. I was about to say something completely random. But um, I'm going to do a quick gameplay just because, you know. But um, it's much easier for GameCube and uh, PS2. Well, this is easy too, but, you know, it's whatever. Just to... I don't have my control set up, fuck. I don't even have the punch button. Never mind, we're not doing gameplay. But that's how you do it. If you guys like this video, uh, give it a thumbs up, share it. Please share it because I was looking and I could not find a way to do it anyway. But um, just, you know, share. Uh, please share because there was literally, I could not find any other way to do it. But uh, if you guys like the video, like I already said, like it, share, subscribe. Um, you can follow me on Twitch if you want. Uh, link will be in the description. But if you don't want to do that, um, twitch.tv slash playzo2. Trying to hit affiliate. But yeah. Uh, appreciate you watching. <laughs>